Hello, and welcome to our second session um, of our data visualization class. Um, today, there will be no R whatsoever. Um, yesterday, you got an introduction to how to use R and how to make some simple uh, plots with ggplot. And tomorrow, we'll do a lot more with that and for the rest of the mini-mister. Um, but today, we're going to cover a whole bunch of basic graphic design principles so that the things that you make um, look good. Um, and hopefully by the end of this, um, your lives will have been totally changed and you'll never look at a random flyer in the library or um, just on the street the same again. You'll be able to critique it and understand why it looks bad or why it looks good and how you can improve it. Um, so that's what we'll be talking about today, which is exciting. Um, so let's go ahead and go to the slides for today and we'll start talking about the, um, the course content. So what we're gonna be covering today are a few um, core principles. Uh, we'll do a quick review of the stuff we talked about yesterday, um, connecting truth and beauty and data and how that's related. Um, and then connecting why we care about graphic design with all of that and how design can actually improve the truth of something and make it easier to understand and easier to communicate. Um, then we'll talk about the core principles of graphic design. And the easiest way to remember it for this class is with this fun acronym, CRAP, C-R-A-P, which stands for Contrast, Repetition, Alignment, and Proximity. Um, and so by the end of the session today, you'll understand how to apply those four principles to any designed object and to make your own great designs. Um, then we'll briefly at the end talk about um, difference in, differences in the types of images that you'll be creating um, and where it's appropriate to store these images and what, under what conditions should you make a JPEG or a, or a PNG or other types of files. And so that's what we'll be talking about today. So let's get started. <laughs> 